Yo, what's good everyone? It's ZigZag here. Welcome back to another GeoGuessr video. Good to have you along on the channel once again today. And today is a very important day because we're going to be playing what is perhaps the hardest map in all of GeoGuessr. Now, I know I said that in the last video when we played Pain and Suffering, but as you can see in the description of Pain and Suffering is left an even harder map called whatever it's called, Par Parabal Versta. And I said if we hit a thousand likes, we'll play it. We hit 2.3 thousand, which is crazy. Probably the most likes I've ever gotten on a video with less than 100,000 views. So thank you so much. Um, let's try and hit the same this video. I mean, why not? Um, hit like if you are enjoying this series. Anyway, we're going to be trying out this for the first time today. I've never even set eyes on this map. I noticed that the average score is indeed lower, even despite the fact that it has so few locations. So it is easier to remember the locations. But yeah, we're going to try on no moving, panning or zooming to conquer this map. Are we going to conquer it? Absolutely not. But we'll find out how it goes. Okay, no moving, panning or zooming. Can we pull any insane guesses today? Let's get an idea of what this is like. I think off the back here that we're in the British Indian Ocean territories. I don't know what these plants are here, but this extremely dense um, foliage with tons of palms seems to show up there really often. These are over here. You look for where it says British Indian Ocean Territories, and then these ones don't have coverage. I think this even might have people on it. Uh, yeah, it does. But these ones don't have coverage. Instead, the ones just north of it here in the archipelago here and up here have coverage, and I'm going to guess on this one right here. Let's test our luck. Oh no, I was so confident. And this one was Cocos and Keeling. Uh, and we start off on Direction Island there, which yes, I've seen that before. And to be fair, they are pretty much the closest islands between each other. There's nothing out here between. So in some sense, it's not a terrible guess, but we still get zero points, of course. So not the best start. Next one here. Okay. Mm. So this one almost gives me a similar vibe. I almost want to go back to British Indian Ocean Territories. I don't think this one's Cocos, although it could be. Um, and then this one could definitely also be American Samoa or something else out this direction as well. I could definitely see that. Um, no, but something about the, uh, the ground here does remind me of maybe Cocos or British Indian Ocean Territory. And I think I will uh, try this again because, you know, second time lucky, right? Let's see if we are correct about that. Okay, this time it was the British Indian Ocean Territory, but Nelson's Island, so I'm getting the feeling that instead of clicking here for easy points, it's always going to be something a little bit further out this time. But, fair enough, we got 3.8k there, which in the grand scheme of things is pretty good, so let's see what we get next round. Okay, so we have oil palms here, and I definitely get a Southeast Asia vibe, so I would have thought this was just Sumatra or Kalimantan. Um, could he have found, the creator of the map, something crazy in terms of uh, palm plantations in, I don't know, Malaysia, Philippines, Bangladesh even, I thought of here. I think that we should just guess Sumatra and see what this... Oh, I just flipped my mouse. Um, I think we should see what this map is actually capable of. And um, yeah, let's guess in Sumatra and see uh, how wrong we could possibly be here. Jumbi would be the standard guess for a round like this. Okay, well, not too bad. We get eight points. <laughs> I guess it is kind of bad, but it is uh, just in a, it is in a palm plantation area. So yeah, East Kalimantan, you'd still see quite a lot of palm plantations. So it makes sense. We're on a two country streak. I feel like this is back in the British Indian Ocean territories, maybe. It definitely has that same foliage on the ground. So I'm gonna slam it in here. Uh, not really worth picking an exact spot. Uh, this one was the Samoan Island. So they do look pretty similar. I think the like soil is a bit darker. And this is, of course, on the island that's not marked. So yeah, definitely a hard one. Uh, next one here. Immediately struck me as Brazil out in the Amazon. But there are still other countries that are possible. Uh, we actually do have a palm here right above my webcam. Hello. Um, which kind of looks, I would say, a bit Brazilian as well. It kind of reminds me of a para palm. So I'm thinking like guessing Santarém here. Or maybe Marabá or something like that. Um, do I like Marabá? Yeah, I think I like Marabá here. Let's, let's give that a go. And okay, well, it's nearer to Santarém, but that's still a good region guess. We got the state. Only 200 points, of course, but still not too bad there. So, seems like everything is clustered around the equator. That's my uh, little thought here to make the scoring worse. Um, we get 4,000 points despite getting the country three times. So, uh, yeah, let's head back in here again, see if we can improve on that score. Obviously, people will have gotten good scores on here, so I hope to myself. Next one here. This kind of reminds me of Christmas Island. Extremely dense vegetation, but not quite as tropical as the other ones we've had. Um, even though it should be, but it's just more forested, so you don't quite get as many palm trees and stuff. I'm thinking this is correct. If not, something in Southeast Asia. So let's see if we're right. Ah... Yep, I got baited by the map a bit there. That was just a standard 
um, Columbia. We were definitely on a road that's not even marked, so probably a trekker inside the forest there, but still. Okay, we'll restart. Obviously, the first round we got 4,000 points. We want, a, we want a better score than that if we can help it. Okay, next one here. This, I think I recognize as northern Botswana somewhere. These kind of really wide-brimmed trees. Now... The question is, are we in the Kasane National Park, like this road up here? So it would appear that we are going kind of easterly here, east-west, so that definitely could fit for this area. Although I'm not really sure if there's any mountains or like hills up here, because we definitely see a hill of some kind. I think there are, but not big ones. Um, then we could also be on this road, where is it? The road to this hill? Oh, uh, that could certainly work here. East-west? Maybe doesn't quite fit as bad as, uh, as good as the Kasane stuff, but it could certainly be there. I'll be disappointed if it is there, but as it stands, I think the road angle that we see here should mean that we're not there. And then the other possibility is that we're on the Mound Road, which, or, or somewhere around these roads, or on the Mound Road, which goes northeast of Mound, which again, the angle doesn't quite fit as well as where we are here. So I think I'm going to go for this, guys. Pray. I hope this is decent. Let's find out. And it was actually Uganda. Wow, I was so sure I was right. <laughs> you have to give the map some credit. That was a hard one. I was like, wow, I was sure. Okay, well, I guess we were as close as we could have been in... Uh, okay, man, it's going to do it to me again. I think... Wait, let me actually be objective here. I think that this bush actually may look more Ugandan now that I've seen it twice in a row. I think this is going to be the same place. Guys, if I'm wrong, this is going to be so funny. But I think I'm right. I think I'm right. Let's go. Okay. Trust me to actually get it the second time. That's good. We have a good score. Let's see what we get next. Okay. This is Australia. This is definitely up in this kind of northern Darwin area of Australia. Um, and I would say if it's a hard round, we should be all the way out in Kakadu here. And we are going uh, almost directly south here, but slightly... Um, slightly eastern is that correct yeah so i would say let's look for an angle that fits here like maybe there um or it could be like right here or oh, this could work i mean if if it's going to be extremely cheeky that could work i think maybe it does hmm wetlands oh it does feel kind of wet we have a lot of palms here maybe this would be slightly better or like that mm, i don't know I am curious. I do think it's somewhere along the Kakadu Road, but it's such a huge place that we we could hedge in the middle. Let's not do that. Let's go for a good. Let's go for, go for a good one here. I think it is green enough to say we're maybe on the north part here. Let's guess like this, and not too bad. Okay, let's just over here in um, Cottle Creek, so not on the main road like I thought, but we get we guess pretty well. That's four thousand points. Okay, so a really good start here. We're Nine thousand already, and now we have to overcome one of these ones. Hmm. Okay, first thought was, again, with the dark forest, that this might be Christmas Island. I don't think so in hindsight. Um, could this be another um, Colombian rainforest? It could be, though I don't think I'm too keen on that either. This, though, could be one of the Samoan Islands, maybe. Could it ever be that hidden island? The, uh, the, the uh, kind of, uh, <laughs> what shape is this? The, uh dark blue quadrilateral uh, shape here. I'm not so sure about that, but the darker soil does seem to fit. Are they snakes? No way. No, no, no. Um, <laughs> I'm too Australian to uh, not notice that. Um, okay. Hmm. What, what do we want to go for here? Maybe it actually just could be another British Indian Ocean. This one's really generic. This one's super generic. Um, yeah. Hmm. Maybe, maybe actually Christmas Island is the best bet because there is quite a lot of coverage on Christmas Island that can look like this. So I think I'm going to go for that. Um, wish me luck. Let's find out what it actually is. Oh, oh, it was 4.6 kilometers. Okay. Cooking with gas. I knew it felt familiar. We have a great score here, guys. We have a great score. Pray for easy ones. I can actually just ace it. This would be insane. Okay, let's see. I think it's there again. This is like the kind of deep forest that I, that I associate with Christmas Island. I can't go for anything else. I'm pretty sure this is like very similar vegetation to the last time. The threat is that this is one of the Amazonian ones or one of the Colombian ones. Like one of the ones that we saw out here. I, however, am more so leaning towards our good friend Christmas Island, which came through clutch last time. So let's see if I'm right about that. Nope, this was... Oh no, I was actually on it. Okay, so it's it's especially dark in there. Um, 
man, we could have got it. That would have been a crazy guess. But, alas, it wasn't to be. Okay, let's see what we get next. And this one's very familiar. This might be like Crazy Trekker in um, Bolivia or something. I think it's like Bolivia or something in the Atacama or maybe Mexico, but I don't think the vegetation quite fits for Mex. Or oh, there is that like one crazy place in Arge as well. There is like a national park in Cordoba that looks like this, but I think this is too dry. So I'm, I'm thinking this is like in this national park here maybe. Or is it another one? Let me see. There's a few national parks out here. I think it might be the Deep South one, actually. Um, would there be that much vegetation there? Maybe. Um, or this one. No, I don't think it's that one. I think it's the South one. Uh, if I remember it correctly, then it's the South one. If this is Cordoba, then I made a crazy call, because I feel like there's like one, like one valley only where it looks like this. But I think, I think we're more likely to be correct here. Let's find out. Oh no. That's Colombia. You're joking. Okay, that is legitimately very difficult. I mean, how does it get that dry? I don't know. It's just up in the mountains, but... Okay, we ended up with a 13,800. Let's see what that puts us in the leaderboard. Surely, that at least gets us on. It does. Number nine, which is I think is pretty good. But uh, we'll have to go for one more here just to find out if we can actually... Or one more good attempt where we get for good first two rounds. Okay, first one. This one... Uh, does it feel... Does it feel, this one might feel more Amazonian again. I'm gonna try Amazon here. Um, and it was, was it this one or this one? Maybe this one, I think. Oh no. Oh wow. That makes sense. I've seen that before. Okay. Okay. Good to know that that's in the uh, genre of dark forest. They are very hard to guess. Um, well, this one has big ferns, by the way. This could be like New Zealand or something with those ferns, but I think it's a bit too tropical. But maybe we can use that logic. Maybe this would be like out this direction, Samoa or something like that. Let's try, let's try, um, let's try the, let's try the, uh, the, the, uh, rhombus, the, uh, dark circle. Okay. Really good guess considering we got zero points. But yeah, this was actually New Zealand adjacent. It was Vanuatu. Okay. Good to know. We can remember that by the ferns. That's definitely gettable for next time. Okay. Next one. Mm, this feels Colombian. Now this one actually does feel Colombian, even though we have the big ferns. Um, oh, maybe I'm wrong, we'll see. But I think I'm gonna go for uh, some national park, not Bogota. We had one around I Ibagué, Ibagué. Um, yeah, like here, it was right here, wasn't it? Well, it was like somewhere around there, let's try that. Not bad, okay, it was just Bogota, but that's 2.5K. Pretty acceptable score on this map. Next one here, British Indian Ocean to me. We have that darker soil, which I did associate with the, uh, with the Samoan Islands, but I think it's more likely to be here. So I'm going to try that. And of course, why don't we try for Nelson Island this time? <laughs> because it was there last time and I feel like he's going to put more of them. So uh, let's find the archipelago. There it is. Egmont. Wait, why can't I actually? Okay, there we are. And there's Nelson. Go for it. Let's see. Oh my gosh, it is that one. Okay, so the darker soil definitely actually does work. Good to know. I just want to get one more good start. We'll get two good rounds in a row. Okay, we're going to repeat finally. I can get this one. Um, it was here. It was here. Was it that one? Hmm. Maybe I can't get it. Maybe it was... No, it wasn't that close to Midian. I think it was this one. Wait, not that one. No. This was like in the heart of where I thought it would be green. So I think it has to have been this one. Yeah. Um, yeah, good. Okay, nice. 8.5 kilometers. Like, like, starting like that is good. Okay. <clears throat> we have ferns, but we don't have proper New Zealand ferns. I still think Porto Velho, or whatever, what's it called? No, not Porto Velho, that's in Brazil. What's well, actually called in, um, in Vanuatu? Porto Vato, it could be Port Vato. Uh, do I love it? I'm not sure I love it, but I do think it's possible. I think we maybe should go for it. If not, Samoa, I think, but I'm gonna go there. Let's try it out. Ah, it's Samoa, bro, can I not? I lose the 50-50s, but don't worry, we're one more good start. Two rounds in a row, good start, then we can continue out the seed, okay. This is random. Not something we've seen before on the map. This almost feels like Europe or something. Um, but we can't guess Europe. Let's guess Galapagos Islands or something for fun. I have no idea. Okay, was uh, actually Tanzania. Makes sense. Similar latitude, but uh, not a good guess. Uh, good to know that. Feels a bit, more, a bit more temperate. Okay, this one, I would just go for Colombia. If he's included Colombian forests. Um, no, this one was actually, wow, it's the National Park in Malaysia. That's such cool coverage. I mean, you do see some amazing places in this map. Okay, this one. 
Uh, oh, I'm dreading these now. I just don't. I don't think I quite have the vibe yet. But let's try Christmas Island. I think it's. I think it's a good shout. We'll see. Okay, what's Christmas Island? Christmas Island, nice, good start. Okay, this one is a repeat. We have the snakes on the ground. And I think this one was also Christmas Island, unless I'm misremembering. Oh no. This repeat, or was it the Samoan one? It was one of the two. And I think, oh my gosh, man. I, I can't believe I'm gonna throw this, but I don't remember. Oh. No, I think, I think I have to trust the Dark Soil. I think this one was a, oh no, re my repeat memory's never been that good, but this is kind of shameful. Okay, I'm gonna try it, I'm gonna try it. I think it was here. It was there on Christmas Island, surely. Oh no, oh, I just didn't, oh no. Let's see what we would have had. Oh no, 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 I have to reset, guys. I want a better score. <laughs> oh no, I can't believe I threw that. The snakes, the snakes were the, well, that was the one I considered for a long time and then got correct. That's just annoying. Okay, let's slam this one in Bogota. It's correct. 1k though, I mean, we can't really start with a score like that. You really have to know the repeats or get the island correct. Okay, this one kind of looks like Christmas Island or Coco's or something to me. Um, it could be a Samoa as well. It's a bit, a bit, the camera's a bit hazy like Samoa actually. I think I'm gonna get Samoa here. Um, which island of the three though is the best? Uh, here we are in Samoa. Um, I think it might look like, mm, I think it might look like this island, actually. I think I, like, remember, like, a road out here looking similar to this. Nope, that was actually British Indian Ocean. Okay. Whew. Keep calm. I mean, I know it's meant to be the last map, but I really want to get that correct, you know, outcome here. I want to get a good score. Okay, we have seabirds here. I think we actually might be, I think we actually might trust those for, it could be some more again. I think I might trust those for a bit more of a, uh, you know, Wake Island kind of uh, Midway Atoll kind of vibe here. Where am I actually looking for Midway Atoll? There we are. Um, not Midway Atoll itself, obviously. Not this one, because that's actually marked on the map. We need to find the one that's not even marked on the map, you know. Could be between them. Okay, we actually, we actually might struggle to find it. I'm pretty sure it's somewhere like kind of horizontally between them. Oh, hello. Could be these ones. Southeast Island. Yeah, let's go for uh, Southeast Island. Why not? Oh no, it was just some more. Oh my gosh. I, have I got it right, right once, guys? This is actually so annoying. Some more is actually just, I have guessed it so many times as well. Okay, this, hmm. This could be like a dry place in uh, Colombia. I, I don't know. Something like that, maybe. If we have so much Colombia. Okay, Ecuador. But even, okay, even Peru. Had the right vibe, but yeah. Okay, let's, let's see here. Okay, next one here. We have actually these big ferns again. I think this one might be Vanuatu or Samoa. Uh, I think these ones really do look like New Zealand. So I think we're gonna try Vanuatu. I don't think it's the same repeat that we had last time, but I think it looks similar enough that I feel at least reasonably confident as much as you can on this map. So let us go for it here. It was, it was this island and it was somewhere over here, I think. Okay, nice. That's actually a good pickup. Okay, next round, let's see what we get. Ooh surprisingly gettable round here. Like this is a freebie when it comes to this map. We have 2022 coverage. That's gonna help out somewhat at least. Um, Honestly, to be honest with you, I don't know where this is. Ooh, see, I had no idea, but I look at this tree in the back here, this little pine almost feels like a kind of like South US tree, like Oklahoma or Texas. Not really sure if the dirt fits that well. I mean, it could be Oklahoma but I think it might be more likely still to be Brazil or Northern Colombia. And I've just spied something which completely changes my opinion. We actually have a little like stick fence inside the thickets here. So that would make us probably Colombia, maybe Brazil. Um, and this would have to be Northern Colombia, even though I can't really place this tree inside, but I mean, I don't think it's Mexico. The, the, the saw doesn't really feel right. So yeah. Columbia does make sense. I think that's probably the best guess here. I'm also trying to work out where the sun is. It probably feels like it's about midday. Although if I had to say, does it feel like maybe the sun's a bit north? Which, I mean, we're pretty close to the equator here anyway. Oh, I don't really know. I, I, I do think it's like the, the shadows are being cut, cast slightly southern, which would mean the sun was north, which would mean we'd be southern hemisphere. That would lean us more Brazil. Uh, but I think, well, does it actually look like Northern Colombia? I'm really basing it off the fence here, which is just so common 
in Colombia, but maybe you could actually justify going like Pernambuco or Paraiba here or something. No, I'm going to go for Northern Colombia. I think it's still the most likely. Let's find out if I'm right. Oh no, it was Piaui. I mean, with where I was going to click, we would have had 2k points, but uh, yeah. Okay, next one here is interesting. We low-key have some very different vegetation to what I've been noticing in the previous rounds. And I'm seeing a little bit of purple flowers going on here, which immediately reminded me of like the Portuguese islands, maybe uh, maybe a Madeira or maybe these ones up here. So if we're talking Gen 4, then it would have to be Madeira or this island here. Um, yeah, I mean, they both have quite a few purple flowers and that's even if I'm right, but actually this kind of large leafed plant, no idea what it is, like a hydrangea maybe. Nah, we don't see any flowers, but it kind of looks like that. And they're really common here. So that's kind of my thought. If you're going to pick a remote island, this one kind of works as well. I mean, it would just make sense to be on the map. Um, we could check for copyrights too and see if it's 2021, because that's what they have there. And uh, kind of hard to see. This one might be a one. That makes me feel better about the guess. I mean, it still could be a three, the one and the three often appear similar, but I'm going to go for it here. Let's see if I'm correct. No way! I was feeling good when I thought it was 2021, and that was actually in Malaysia, so there you go. That's what you get for using copyright. Zero points there. Oh, man, I was so talking myself into that one, last one, but this is the one that we saw in Tanzania. Yeah, I remember this one looking a bit weird, and the Tanzanian coverage is all, like, near this city, I think, near Kakabunta. Yeah, Gombe National Park, that's where they have it. So, let's go here. I guess this should be close enough. Yep, nice, 4.9k. Okay, this is a good start. Next one here is impossible. Um, what do we like here? This kind of feels Asian to me. It is very dark. It could be another one, that, one of the Amazonian ones. I think I might just continue this. Look, if you, if you really look, let's say let's say if we hit the like goal, I'll come back and I'll uh, and I'll get a game where I get like at least four correct. But um, I think this would be maybe the Amazonian stuff. Let's let's see if we can make it that. Um, so I think it was here was the national park that we were in last time. So one of these two. So I'm gonna go for that. And this one was actually in Uganda. Okay, fair enough. Zero points, as usual. Okay, this is Australia. Now, this feels like the one I 5K'd on this road here. So, and it was right here. If, if I, I remember it well, because I clicked on this set stretch and it was actually this stretch. So if I'm right, and this is the same area, which I think the vegetation is the same, um, then I'm going to guess right there. Okay, well, it's the same road. Nice. Okay, well, uh, maybe I should have actually checked the angle of the road. It was actually headed east at now in hindsight, but, you know, still a good score. Okay, nice. Next one here. Ooh, circular blur is fascinating. Um, well, it doesn't really help too much anyway. I think this one might be Amazonian. Well, that's kind of my hobby horse to guess at the moment. It doesn't feel like... It, we don't have palms, so it doesn't feel like an island trekker. Too much, at least. Um, ooh, this could actually be, with a circular blur, you know, this could actually be another, um, Ugandan one. And that would make sense for the lack of palms. Okay. Was it here? Yeah, this forest. Yeah. I mean, we don't see any mountains either, which, I mean, obviously we're in a forest, we're not likely to, but that does kind of hurt our theory a bit. But I think that the circular blur actually checks out, because you often get that in Uganda. So let's see if I'm right. Okay, it was just the next one up. That makes sense that it was a bit flatter. Okay, 2.4. We could still get our top score here, I think. What are we on? Uh, 11k, yeah, we can. Ooh, this is familiar. Could this actually be what I guessed before? Could this actually be Galapagos? That's what, immediately what it struck me as, because this feels like nowhere else that I can that I can think of that we've had on this map or similar maps. We've got like blossoms here, fascinating. Could this be Japan? Could these actually be Japanese blossoms? Maybe. Looking at the soil though, it's like very rocky, coarse soil. I think that fits for a place like, yeah, like Galapagos. I think this would be like, Isabella, or maybe the main one, if, if we're there. Um, probably just hedge between them. No, let's actually go for it. We have to go for a nice guess, right? I think I would go on uh, maybe... Mm, yeah, Isla Santiago, I think so. How much plays... Like, how many POIs are there? There's, like, plenty of stuff to do there. Obviously, plenty of stuff to do here. Not so much on Isabella, I've noticed, or here. So, yeah, I think I'm actually going to go for Santiago here. And I I feel pretty good. Like it's a really random tracker. Whatever this is is extremely cool. But I think I've seen similar coverage here before. So let's find out. 
Okay, nice. I mean, we don't get the island, but we get pretty close, all things considered. And we get a score of 15,700. Ah, oh, not too bad there. So let's see where that puts us on the leaderboards. That actually puts us in eighth. So we jumped a few positions, I guess. Well, it feels like there are people playing right now, right? Because that is our top score. And weren't we, weren't we higher earlier in the video? So like, I feel like there's people actually playing right now and grinding, but maybe they saw me playing or something. But uh, guys, thank you so much for, play, for playing along, for watching the video. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing this one. Obviously it was an interesting map to be sure. Uh, 15,000 is a pretty good score, but clearly some people have uh, already mastered all the repeats to uh, get on top here. So well done to you guys, I guess. Uh, but yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, hit the like goal and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a video very soon. Till next time and goodbye.